Today's video clip is a continuation on microscopes. First of all, what is magnification? It is the process of viewing an object enlarged without actually physically enlarging the object, thereby getting to view the finer details of the object three-dimensionally. we define the intensity or degree of magnification that we have achieved. When we say 10x, what does it mean? What is the meaning of x? It means the object is 10 times larger than the original, than the normal. That is what is meant by 10x. We have to know this before we go ahead with understanding the components of the microscope which aid in magnification. So now, let us get acquainted with the parts of the microscope which help with magnification. The four components of the eye microscope which help with magnification are the eyepiece, the binocular tube, the magnification changer and the objective lens. First, let us get acquainted with the term focal length. So what is focal length? Focal length is the distance you hold the lens from the object in order to get the most magnification and the clearest image. It can also be called the ideal working distance for reference. I have already introduced you to the eyepiece in my previous video. The simplest way to relate an eyepiece would be to imagine it like a magnifying glass. The eyepiece has a magnification of around 10x and maybe 12.5x. This is what is used mostly in dental operating microscopes. The second important magnifying component is the binocular tube head. The focal length of the binocular tube head has to be taken into consideration while calculating the total effective magnification. The third important component is the magnification changer. Now over here, depending upon your choice of dental operating microscope, the effect, the effective magnification can be controlled. A three-step magnifier would have lesser magnification than a five-step magnification changer or a six-step magnification changer. The objective lens. It is the first optical magnifying component of the microscope that the image formation crosses on its path from the object to the eye. The focal length of the objective lens could vary from 200 to 250 to 300 mm. These four components of the microscope and their values help us in deriving the effective magnification that we achieve for an object. Well, the formula follows. 